Now here's a beautifully heavily populated cichlid tank where the water is going a little bit yellow quite continually. So after a water change it clears up a little bit but then it gets that yellow tint back again and that yellow tint is called a gilvan tint. So what I'd suggest in this case is whenever you clean the filter to make sure you're using poly filter and um, consider using biochemsorb in the filter because what the biochemsorb will do is suck that gilvan tint out of the water and the gilvan tint is basically just a result of high biological activity so that means there's a lot of bacteria in there that's trying to break down the waste from these fairly big, fairly well fed fish. Um, the other thing too is the redox potential of this tank is potentially quite low. Now the redox potential is basically a signal of how fast the bacteria can work, therefore how much bacteria needs to grow. So this tank's got an air stone and then it's got a canister filter, but for the volume of fish the oxygen demand on the tank might actually be fairly significant. So you've got lots of fish needing the oxygen and then you've got a canister filter which is going to suck the oxygen out of the water as well because the canister filter is going to um, grow all the good bacteria and the good bacteria is going to compete with the fish for the oxygen, making the oxygen level go down. And the lower the oxygen level is, the slower the bacteria works. Therefore, the more bacteria you actually need to break down the waste that's present. And that might be why the water's getting this gilvan tint. So um, I'm also suggesting that we put a power head in the back of the tank to um, agitate the surface more and give more water flow hoping to raise the redox potential because if the redox potential is increased then we shouldn't need to grow as much bacteria to do the same job therefore we shouldn't have as much gilvan tint therefore the water should stay a bit cleaner so for, so for this particular tank um, replacing the poly filter increasing I mean adding biochem and then increasing the amount of oxygen should help to keep this water clearer but there's some really beautiful fish in here.